Even after the legislature adjourns, a task force will continue to study whether to relocate schools for the blind and the deaf. As Adam Pinsker reports, the buildings are in dire need of maintenance. Estimates show it would cost more than $62 million to upgrade the school for the deaf and another $35 million to fix the school for the blind. And that's a lot of money to spend on infrastructure to maintain aging infrastructure. So my personal concern is I would love to see us spending that more, more of that money on curricula. State Senator Liz Brown sits on the task force, which is considering whether finding a brand new home for both campuses would be more cost efficient. Both campuses, both administrations have been very, very open to to looking to see how we can share the best practices while not damaging the curriculum they have. Brown says another possibility is demolishing buildings that aren't being used. That would help reduce costs. But some officials say moving the schools is being rushed because of their location. The buildings sit on valuable real estate in Indianapolis near Meridian Kessler. For Indiana News Desk, I'm Adam Pinsker.